Good evening, good evening. Welcome and welcome back to Miss Joan Uncut with your host, me, Miss Joan. Uh, thank you, all my new subscribers. Thank you for everyone who's been commenting below. It has been a few days. Y'all know how it goes. It is so much to catch up to. I finally went through some stuff and some things just popped out to me and it spoke to me. How I create or how I decide on what videos to make. Once I watch someone's video or content, if I feel like it's something that pulls at me, that be like, this is something I would like to give my opinion on, then I make the video. So because we're here, that would mean something caught my attention, right? So uh, if you are new over here, you are welcomed. Over here, we use logic, common sense, and we don't fall for the the, the wool over the eyes. We don't do that. And how I also do it, I jump right into it. I'm not going to waste your time. And so uh, let's get into it. So today, as I was going through the Jaguar streets, because to be honest, I've been over in the second sector that I frequent in. And baby, it has been going on. Like a lot has been going on. And so I decided to come over here, catch up on some videos. And to my behold, um, I was watching Queen Tulsa earlier in the day. Um, and I noticed Queen Tulsa was playing a lot of like JAG video segments. But then I heard this one particular call or video um, recording, should I say, that Queen Tulsa played. And it was of TJ calling Jaguar trying to make money with Jaguar. And I was like, is this recent? Because I know you lying to me. I know your ass lying to me. So then as the day went on, we get to uh, TJ. I noticed TJ went live. So I decided, let me just, you know, peek in and watch her live. And unbeknown to me, TJ supporters is chewing her ass a new one, honey. Mm-hmm. They were hot. They were pissed and rightfully so because the video came out that TJ caught Jaguar trying to make money with Jag. Now, after everything that has been going on, out of all the stuff she said about your kids, and we're going to get into that part because that's what really made me say, mm hmm, I'm, I'm going to do a video on this one. I said, you got to be lying to me. You gotta be mother lying to me, okay? But we're gonna go ahead and jump into it. So how I wanna start this video off is we're gonna start off with the call. Then we're gonna jump over to TJ and then we're gonna get into like my overall thoughts, okay? So let me go ahead one moment. Okay, so y'all know how I'm going to do. I'm going to screen share. And we're going to get it started. All right, so I got that pulled up. Y'all should see that. So again, this is the video where... TJ is actually calling Jack now from what TJ is saying is Jack kept calling her and calling her and TJ decided to call her back but it really doesn't matter at this point so there we go hello what you want hello what you want are you recording me what you want oh no, seriously because I got a serious business idea that we can do but I don't want to be recorded I got that I'm in the fucking pool okay first of all you don't want to be recorded TJ but yet you know Jag is going to record you Jag will do anything to humiliate you because you ran off with the plug <laughs> okay you didn't ran off with the alleged money this this alleged money right the money you're making from youtube now you got a job so she know you have some some income coming in and she feels like she pretty much she's entitled to anything you make because she felt like she made you so did you honestly think she wasn't gonna record you the woman despises you ciao 
Okay. So what's up? Man. I'm working out. Huh? I'm working out. I just so happened to see this message and I'm calling back. I'm in the fucking pool. Call me, what's call, up? Call me, back when you, call, me, call me back when you don't work no, out. No, no, we can talk now because I'm busy the rest of the day. Oh, well, then. Okay, Jay. Let's talk now. What's up? Oh. We should do, like, um... We can we can make some money behind the paywall. We could do like the conversation, whatever. So- so first, let me shout out Queen Tulsa. This is her content. So I want to be respect, um, respect, misrespectful. Uh, and ciao. The fact that TJ is calling, trying to make money with someone who is literally accusing you of stealing from them is beyond me. Me personally, I'm going to just come out and say it. I think TJ was missing Jag. There's you is there's no way that you go from you'll never deal with Jag again. She talked about my kids, but yet you're calling her because you want to help her make money. Please make that make sense to me. Cause when it's to the dirt with you, it's to the dirt with you. When I say I don't rock with you, I don't rock with you. Once you sit out here and do a smear campaign on me. Now, though they made it on each other, they've been doing that to each other. Let, let me tell you something. TJ supporters got in her ass. Rightfully so. These people are helping you keep a roof over your head while you build up your money and save up your money. And you... Since everybody worried about it. Since we yeah. really haven't talked since we separated. What you talking about? A conversation? Make- a conversation about what? So listen, TJ... Beloved is in a here. Let's do this one more time. Okay. I got that. I'm in the fucking pool. Okay. Okay. So what's up? Man. I'm working out. I'm working out. I just so happened to see this message and I'm calling back. I'm in the fucking pool. What's up? Call me back when you don't work. No, out. no, we can talk now because I'm busy the rest of the day. Oh, well, then, okay, Jay. Let's talk now. What's up? Oh, we should do like um, we can we can make some money behind the paywall. We could do like the conversation, whatever. Since everybody worried about it, since we really haven't talked since we separated. What you talking about? A conversation? Make- a conversation about what? About us, our relationship, or whatever the case. What is. relationship? You were lying, and I'm oh, tired okay. of it. What? We could pay. We could pay to put a link. Like I'm just trying to say, if you try to make some money. So TJ plan is let's jump on a panel together, and let's make people pay for the link. TJ, is your supporters not helping you enough? Because, girl, you walking around here with new clothes. Your edges is laid, girl. You got a job. You look clean. I know your supporters is helping you out tremendously. I've been in the chat. I see it myself. You went from looking busted, ran down, ran astray, ran amok to Mrs. Clean. While Jag is over there selling the, the punani to keep a roof over her head. And you thought to help Jag... By making people pay to hit a link to talk to you both. If that's not I miss you, I don't know what is. You want to make some money? Uh-huh. Where's the check? Check. Hey, friend, how you doing today? I'm well. How's the dog doing? What's his name? Tank. That's it. <laughs> Good, good. Okay, so what's up? TJ Let's hung up on her ass. <laughs> Very desperate. And- Come on. I bet I am. Huh? I'm in the fucking uh-huh. pool. Okay, so that's what I'm saying. So what's up? Like, what you talking about making money behind uh-huh. a paywall? You freaking up. Yeah, we can do it behind 
Is there a, like pay per view? We should, I like. I have a really good idea where we can really make some money. Yeah. Fuck it. You say everything is content, right? Everything is content. All content ain't good content. Right. <laughs> This is why people keep calling TJ weak. This is why TJ keeps getting dogged out by other content creators and most likely like subscribers. Because every time we turn around, she's in Jag face. And this is why nobody be believing when TJ and Jag saying they're done, especially TJ. Because like, I don't... I don't understand. Like, why would you want to make money with someone who literally had their support, their their mob squad, their enablers, their cult mem members, have their son approach you, literally defame you, have whole like Jaguar is obsessed with TJ, but she has an obsessive personality. Anytime she feel like you betrayed her, she obsessed about you until she get a new victim. So Jag is never gonna let up off TJ neck. But for some reason, TJ wants to be this kumbaya come to me moments and not realizing, girl, get a little backbone, pull up your big girl panties, and do what you need to do, which is Leave her the fuck alone, okay? Need some money, and so do I. So, like, let's be real. What makes you think I need money? Because you do need money. You rely on the fan funding. I like, call Jack. Yeah, fan funding is fan funding. That has absolutely nothing to do with anything else. Yes, it does. But Jack, you got to put it together. Like, I, come on. Yeah, I know. Then I do a good job. Hmm. Child. You breaking up. So either you want to or, or you I don't. I said, didn't I do That's a good job? Saying. You actually thought that shit was real? You thought you breaking up. Do you honestly think that anything that I showed you was real? And here go infamous Jag. Thinking that she's outsmarted someone, thinking she's played and, oh, everything I did was, it was a setup from the beginning to catch. Girl, bye, child. Look. <laughs> This is why I don't watch everything or make content because constantly listening to Jag will drive you crazy. It will drive you insane. What? None of it was real. Like everything you would be saying would be cool if it was real, but it was what? never real. It was okay. It was still content. You and me was never real. It was real. None of it. It's all a lie. Okay, and it's still content. It's still content. If it wasn't real for you, it was real for me. It's still content. What was real so, for you? Like, Using me for a bag, lying me up. This game was lying. What the fuck did I use you for? You ain't have shit for me to use you for. Stop. That's facts. Because they both was broke and dusty. I mean, TJ came with a car initially in the beginning. And maybe a little money saved up. But other than that, Jack didn't have squat. She was fresh out of the jail. She was fresh out of the, the joint. Jack just... Oh, child. Wow. You feeling yourself, huh? No, I'm feeling myself. You know, the views is looking a little unimpressive lately. Jack, what? Your views are looking kind of bad. What the fuck did I use you for? Wow. You trying to use me right now? Yo, we wow. did. We did. Trying to figure out. Fucking bitch. Must be out of here. Goddamn. Damn. She's straight just. TJ keep doing it to herself. This is why no one can feel sorry for her. This is why people don't really be having no empathy for her. This is why there's a lot of people reluctant to even wanting to fuck with I fuck with TJ or support her. Granted, she do have supporters because I do believe in forgiving people. Now, I'm going to always have a, a issue with TJ as far as allowing some strange woman be able to attack your children and you provided them the information to do so because for God's sakes, I don't know why you wanted to please the crazy heifer, but you did it. And then you had the audacity the audacity. Okay. The motherfucking audacity to try to work with her and make money with her. 
Something is seriously wrong with you, ma'am. So now the video I'm going to be playing is TJ response to that video. Because what happened is once that video was out, TJ supporters was just like, what the hell? Now, TJ claims she already had told her supporters the day prior. She called TJ. But the way her supporters acted in that chat, it don't seem like that. Mm -mm. And it's like they they was holding her ass accountable. And she just kept using, I'm human and I'm being me, girl. Nobody say you're not being you. Nobody saying you're not human, girl. I will hope you human. Girl, you something else than a human. Girl, that was a stupid ass move. That was foolish. That was stupid. It made you look like a real big dumbass. Girl. Every cash app Jack sent to me, we used it on rums and food. Transportation. Come on. Lay back. She showed last night on her call log about how many times she call and call and call and call and call and call and call. And call. So I'm gonna address it. Yes. I said, let's have a conversation. You're on these panels, you lying on me. I still not have addressed a lot of things that were said. I'm trying to heal. Girl, what 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 is it that you have to address? See, this is what happens when new people come in that think they know Jag. That's how you know Jag supporters, her her enablers, her panelists. Except maybe with the exception of like Queen Tulsa, because Queen Tulsa been around the same. I've I've seen her in the same chats I was in when Jag first hit YouTube. So I, I, that's a whole nother. But the rest of these people, they must be new to Jag, because everything Jag do is not new. It's a repeated cycle and repeated patterns. She does the same shit to each person. There's only one person out of her little circle of chaos that she does not dog out, and that's Solar. But she dogs out Goomba, her first husband, the music industry, Legina, uh, DJ Genesis, uh, Official King Payne, Sean Davey Way, uh, who else? Uh, Donat. Uh, who else? Who else has she dealt with? She used to dog out Nosy Ho. She even has Sweet Ma up there. Now, if you know... Jack, when Jack was over there with Nosy Ho, that was around the time when Sweet Mind them was also kind of doing content on Jaguar. But when she first was really starting to do her little her YouTube pour uh, tour, pouring from panel to panel to content creator to content creator. Jag has nothing else left. Her bread and butter was TJ. Mistreat TJ, TJ come crawling back, humiliate TJ, TJ come crawling back. And now look where we at. TJ calling her to about some, let's get some money together. Girl. And move forward. But we have a right Child. to face our accusers. Lord. She's in a situation. I'm in a situation. Excuse my language, but bitch, this is not law and order. Face what accusers? Grow the fuck up. That's my e issue with TJ. Me and TJ is literally a couple years apart. Girl, grow up. Grow up. You a big girl now. Grow up. Face what accuses. Bitch, you ain't on trial. I'm sorry, y'all, because it be the ignorance for me. We have members only to help ourselves. It's content. You done made my whole life into content. I'm sorry. But you saw Jag on YouTube. That's how you seen Jag. That's what made your ass run out there to go beat Captain Saving Ho. You knew dealing with Jag, your life was going to be content. So cut the shit, please. I cannot stand when people play in my face. That shit not cool. Excuse my language. That's when a person is literally mind fucking you. Girl, you can't tell me whatever. You cannot piss on my leg and tell me it's raining, boo. You knew what you was getting yourself into. You just didn't know you was going to become the main attraction.
Deborah, what are you talking about? This was yesterday. This is the issue that me and all of y'all talked about yesterday, Miss Deborah. They don't act like it. Mm -hmm. They don't act like it. When I talked about the feedback. Hey, Dimples, baby. But you've affected my baby. And see, that's what we're not going to do. See, that's what we're not going to do. We're not going to sit here and be like, oh, you affected my baby. Because what TJ is getting ready to do, because I'm not going to make this a long video. I just wanted to get my point out. She's getting ready to play this whole, I can't find my daughter, Brie. She's relapsed. She's back on drugs. No one can find her. She won't talk to me. But yet you were willing to contact Jaguar and still make money with her. Please make that make sense to me. How is it you are so affected by what she did to your daughter? Because again, you gave her that information. You so affected, you're so offended, you was willing to break bread with her. Make up your mind. Girl, just say you missed her. I can respect that more than you sitting here playing woe is me. She she hurt my child, but hey, I'm trying to have people come up to the link and pay us to hit the link. Bitch, if that's not a contradiction, I don't know what is. Oof, child. It be the ignorance for me. I can't even find my kid. And that's okay. You stole my phone and that's okay. You lie on me and that's okay. Yet you was willing to just make money with her though. And that's okay. Girl. Anybody can call a phone when you block the number out, Miss Deborah, Miss Barbara. I've never called, I have not called Jay in 17 days. I texted her and told her to call me. So you didn't call, you told her, wait, you said you didn't call her in 17 days. You told her to text you. What's the difference? Please tell me y'all seeing this. This is why I cannot jump on the bandwagon with everybody. This is why I refuse to play along and play the Hunger Games with everybody. Girl, make it make sense, please. No, you're wrong, Jessica. She called me. Who is a victim? Who's a victim? I've never once said I was a victim. Not, never, 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 never said. Child, the fact that she going that hard on them nevers, meaning somebody lying. Okay. I was a victim. I said I made some poor choices. You think? You think I made some poor choices and you keep making them. I made some poor choices. Even before I met Jack, I made some poor choices. Girl, we all make poor choices. Nobody's perfect. I don't expect her to make poor, uh, perfect choices. We're all throughout life make bad choices and we learn from them. But girl, you keep making the same obvious ones. That's the problem. You're not learning from the first, second, or third time. And I'm reflecting on it. And I'm human. But when people block their number out... <laughs> You still get through. It does not matter if their number is blocked or 
all I'm hearing is excuses, excuses, excuses. Because it's called changing your number, boo. Not. Mm. Mm-mm-mm. Shout. Shay? That chat getting in her ass. Miss Barbara, it ain't even just about the three months. Mm -hmm. I think maybe I haven't explained that. It's not just about the three months. It's just about who I've been as a person, period. And what I've allowed in my life from people, period. Like somebody asked me the other yesterday, what are your goals, CJ? To love TJ a little bit better. Girl. That's it. There's a problem when a person loves themselves more than they love their kids. I don't care what anybody say. Yes, you don't neglect yourself. Yes, you are to love yourself. Self-love. Pour back into yourself. I'm a big believer in that. But when you can love yourself a little bit more than you love your children, that's a problem for me. And it will forever be a problem for me. And the fact that you love yourself a little bit more than you love your children because you allow that woman to attack your children to where one of your children relapse girl all anybody could do is look at your ass because it's you now you shouldn't do it jag didn't get the information on all that's it jessica Y'all tell me to do these things. It takes money to do things. Every dollar that I get, I have to budget. Yeah. Where's home, G? You, you got an opinion. Where's home? Where's home? Mm. Nice is not my home. What part of that you don't understand? I hang up and she called back. And did y'all not see the call off? Back to back to back. I think she low key likes it. I, that's just my personal opinion. I could be absolutely, completely, positively wrong. But I honestly think she likes it. Because again, it's called change your number, boo. And the fact that you kept the same number, the fact that you texting her so you think you slick by saying i don't call her but you text her girl it's the same thing you're reaching out it doesn't matter whether you call her text her send a kite send a paper airplane slingshot it over send an owl put in a little glass and send it down the river <laughs> it doesn't matter you're contacting her and then when she contact you back Y'all want to play this? You call me. No, you call me. No, you call me. No, you call me. I never in my life seen grown as women act like children. This bad. Back to back to back to back to back. So what I learned yesterday, everybody does not deserve your time. You think? Girl. Jessica, since you know my life, you tell me what I have going on. That's another thing. Why are you in Texas? How many people break up with people? Do you leave the state because you broke up with that person? I am. Girl, yes. There are people who literally move to a whole new town, whole new state just to get away from the person they broke up with because of how toxic they are. But yet... <laughs> This girl will find every excuse in the book. I swear. I swear. This is why I cannot. I see like a lot of people jumping on the TJ train and oh, TJ, TJ, TJ. It's like, I get it. Nobody's perfect. But I feel like I, I kind of see sometimes what Jack talks about when it comes to TJ. TJ plays this whole woe is me. I'm innocent act. And oh, I'm, I'm trying. And 
Oh, woe is me, and I'm just trying to be a better TJ every day. But yet, low key, she does she does a lot of dumb shit. She's very immature. She's very mentally unfit. She child, she's just a little bit less crazier than Jack. That's all. I'm starting my life over. Is Thank things about Naisha I have not shared. Is a reason why I left. I'll find out, Sharita, how much the number costs to change it. Definitely. I can't drop a link because I'm not on the stream yard. Okay, so I'm gonna leave it there. If you wanna go watch this video and pick up from where I left off, I left off at the 21 minute mark and 32 seconds. That is the 21 minute mark and 32 seconds. My overall wrap up about this, I think it's full of crock. I think maybe her heart, right? Cause I don't, I know I'm coming off hard. I know I'm coming off very hard. So let's, I, I don't want to play devil's advocate. Heck no. Nah. But let's just look at it from a different perspective, right? Maybe her heart was in a good place, in the right place. And I ain't going to say good, in the right place. Maybe she just saw like, oh, poor Jag. Jag is over there pimping out her punani for some money. And maybe, you know, we can just hustle this together. Because I know when we were together, we made a lot of money together. Maybe. Let's just throw that out there, right? Let's just toss it and just hope it lands. And then she calls Jack and Jack just treated her like shit, like shit on the bottom of her shoe. And she just wiped it on grass. <sighs> then you come back to your life. I'm trying. I'm not perfect. And this is home and I didn't want to go back. <sighs> there are people that are going through either worse shit or just as bad shit as TJ. And they put on a big girl panties and they handle their business. Granted, I understand it's hard to leave people that you feel like you love. That you feel like it's hard for you to shake. I'm a very reasonable person, right? Because we all have either been in love with someone, love someone that we have a hard time letting go. Until we just to ourselves just couldn't take no more. But the like most of us don't go through someone on going online and having a whole panel of people, cult members, I like to call them, enablers, trash, just trash you. Granted, yes, TJ came out, said she got affected puss. You know, Jag had affected puss. She then came out and said all these things about Jaguar and she's a, she's a H-O-E, a ho, 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 all that, all that. TJ is not innocent by far. But because Jaguar is who she is, what she say is probably going to just stick and land a little bit more than what TJ do just because of who Jag is. And because she gets a bunch of people to do her dirty work for her until they catch on and be like, Kulu, and in his live he did today, he like, uh-uh, don't put my name on shit. If I ain't say it, don't put my name on it. Jag is getting everyone into her mess. Jag has it out for TJ. Everyone keeps telling TJ, but then TJ just wanted to call Jag to make some money together. But then follow up with, she she hurt my child. My, I don't know where my child at. My child relapsed. But the same person that hurt your child you're willing to make money with, that's what triggered me. Because that made no sense to me. That's like a person wanted to work hand in hand with someone who took their child's life or who harmed their child physically. Someone who abused their child. But yet, let's let's sell these box of chocolates together. Because together we both need the money. Are you freaking kidding me? Jag have came out and said outlandish things. She's out of your business. And you know why I can't be really mad at Jag about it? Because you told her. And even though TJ will be like, I know I was wrong for doing that. I don't really think you grasp the concept of you fucked up. What did he say in a minister society? 
you know you fucked up, right? You can't put that all on Jag, ma'am. Anyway, <laughs> that's my rant. That's how I feel about it. I just could not believe what I was hearing. Let me know what y'all think below. Did y'all peep that too, though? Like, if you've seen that, if you heard the call, and then you hear how TJ responded to her making the call, what do y'all think? Am, am I overreacting? Because I really do not understand how in one breath you say you harm my child and the next breath say let's make some money together. Do you think, let me ask y'all, do y'all think they're going to get back together? I don't think Jag will take TJ back. I really don't. I think Jag is so disgusted with TJ. She will, just to be able to tell her no will make Jag have an orgasm, okay? That's just my opinion. But I thank you so much. If you stuck it out to the end, you a real one. I thank you so much for liking, commenting below, and sharing, and subscribing. Now, please make sure y'all comment below. Let me know how y'all feel because I be loving the interaction. I love y'all thoughts and y'all thought process. Sometimes y'all point out things I don't see, and I'm forever grateful for that. So you know how we do over here. I hope you have a blessed rest of your week. And... Bye.